Starlink against Ukraine. U.S. publication revealed how the black market works in Russia. Starlink internal terminals developed by Elon Musk's SpaceX can be purchased in the Russian Federation despite sanctions. One of the sellers noted that the main buyers of the terminals are Russian volunteers who supply their troops who are waging a genocidal war against Ukraine. The Wall Street Journal writes that Moscow seller Oleg said that most of his orders come from the temporarily occupied territories of Ukraine. On the battlefields of Ukraine, Starlink provides instant and largely secure internal access. In addition to solving the age-old problem of effective communication between troops on their commanders, Starlink enables the control of drones and other advanced technologies that have become a critical part of modern warfare. The company has the ability to restrict access to Starlink through geo-sensing, making the service unavailable in certain countries and locations, as well as the ability to deactivate individual devices. Russia and China do not allow the use of Starlink technology because it could undermine government control over information. Musk stated that to his knowledge, no terminals have been sold directly or indirectly to Russia and that the terminals will not operate in Russia. The journalist's investigation revealed that there is a supply chain for Starlink hardware through which backroom deals are carried out in Africa, Southeast Asia and the United Arab Emirates, resulting in thousands of devices falling into the hands of some US enemies and war criminals, including Russian soldiers. Assistant Secretary of Defense for Space Policy, John Plum, said that SpaceX is working with Ukraine to stop the Russians from using the terminals at the front. Moscow troops often did not have the necessary equipment to communicate with their commanders. Russia was trying to introduce new devices that were just entering production at the start of the invasion, but it was difficult for her to implement them on the required scale and technical problems constantly arose. As a result, the Russians were never able to create a reliable, interoperable communication system to conduct complex operations. What's driving the use of Starlink is the need to have secure communications from the tactical edge of operations to headquarters, as well as a secure communication system that can be used to control drones, said Thomas Withington, an associate fellow on security issues at the Royal United Services Institute of the UK. Ukrainian fighters have targeted a large number of military equipment in the territory of the gas station used as a Russian army's warehouse in the occupied Bolshikopani village of Kherson region. The military equipment detected by the Shark drone were hit by the HIMARS missile launcher and destroyed. Pol-21 radio electronic warfare system is among the destroyed equipment. As the warehouse was being used as a repair base, the equipment under repair were blown up as a result of the strike. The number of casualties among personnel is not reported. Это дом. Да ну черным, блядь, дом бы не горел. Да. Не, это заправка. А ну вот сюда чуть проедь, оно будет видно. Да, заправка. Вот петушня, блядь. Заправка мешала то а? Вот тут где-то встань его. Или склады. А? Склады и заправка, да, там же была? Так, заправка у нас вот тут, бы. Склады. Склады втащили. Вот ублюдки, сука. А, Римбаза Таталин пишет. А? Таталин пишет Римбаза. Какая Римбаза там не было? Ну там... вот это вот база, вот, ну там же техника это. Did a blind mystic Baba Vanga predict Moscow terror attack? What are the predictions she had for 2024? The blind mystic Baba Vanga, hailed as the Nostradamus of the Balkans, is known for her ability to oversee future events. She has made a number of interesting predictions related to global issues. Turns out, she might also have predicted the recent Moscow terror attack. 
The blind soothsayer from Bulgaria has made a number of predictions for 2024 that revolve around economic and global challenges and terrorist attacks around the world. Particularly, she foresaw the rise in terror attacks around the world. One of her predictions for 2024 is around an assassination attempt on Russian President Vladimir Putin purportedly by an individual from Russia. Her prediction about Putin's possible assassination sparked particular interest given the recent terror attack in Moscow, which claimed the lives of 133. The attack at the Crocus City Hall during a concert marked one of the deadliest terrorist incidents in Moscow in over two decades. Putin pledged to retaliate for the deadly attack. While law enforcers have detained a number of suspects linked to the ISIS terror organization, many questions remain unanswered over the motives behind the attack, with some conspiracy theorists suggesting that large-scale geopolitical conflicts and tensions were behind the attack. In her prediction for 2024, the mystic foresaw that a big country would conduct biological weapons tests. This prediction adds another layer to global security threats. Finally, she predicted a global economic crisis. This prediction can also be linked to the developments in Russia as the global economy might be challenged in the light of expected global shifts in the aftermath of the Moscow terror attack. It should be noted that apart from these grim predictions, the mystic has also foreseen a number of medical breakthroughs that include funding treatments for previously incurable diseases such as cancer and Alzheimer's in 2024.